Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss Maths Olympiad practice paper for class 3. Kids, this is set 7. You can watch more videos on my channel. Number 1. Manoj sells 26 packets of 6 mangoes each and is left with 430 mangoes. How many mangoes did Manoj have at first? Kids, in this question, it's given that he sells 26 packets of 6 mangoes each. That means, in a packet, there were 6 mangoes. So, how many mangoes were there in 26 packets, which we sold, sold out? 26 multiplied by 6. That is, 6 6 are 36. Carry over 3. 6 2s are 12 plus 3 15. 156 mangoes he mano sells. Now he is left with 430 mangoes. So at first he had 156 plus 430. So total 586 mangoes. Answer is option A 586. Question number 2. Weight of rice bag is 21 kilogram more than the weight of wheat bag. If wheat weighs 79 kilogram, then what is the weight of rice bag? Rice bag is 21 kilogram more than the weight of wheat bag. And the weight of wheat bag is 79 kilogram. So 21 kilogram more than 79 is 79 plus 21. That means 9 plus 1 is 10, 0, carry over 1. 7 plus 1 is 8, plus 2, 10. So the weight of rice bag is 100 kg. Answer is option A. Question number 3. Priyanka buys 21 cupcakes for her friends every day. How many cupcakes does she buy in the month of December? Priyanka buys 21 cupcakes every day. So, in a day she buy 21 cups, cupcakes and there are 31 days in the month of December. This is clear? So, how many cupcakes she will buy, she buy in the month of December? 31 multiplied by 21 that is 651. 1 multiplied one by 1 is 1. 1 3 is 3. Two, uh, now here 0, 2 1s are 2 and 2 3s are 6. So 1, 2 plus 3 is 5 and 6 is here. So answer is 651. Option C. Kids, if you understand this question, please like this video. 4. Sohan has two baskets full of some number tokens. He liked the numbers that are in red basket. Which of the following numbers formed by using given basket number he like the most? So he likes red basket. And the number in the up red basket are 6, 5, 9, 2. In options we can make option A has 8 which is not in red basket so this option is Cancel. In option B, 6, 5, 2, 9. So answer is option B because all numbers are present in red basket. Question number 5. If the room temperature is 7 degree less than the difference between the temperature shown on thermometers A and B, then what is the room temperature? It's, it's given that the room temperature and thermometer A is 55 and the temperature in the thermometer B is 45 because it is between 40 and 50. So this is 45. Now what is the difference between 55 and 45? This is 55 minus 45 is 10. So, difference between the thermometer A and B is 10. 
and the temperature the room temperature is 7 degree less than the difference between the thermometer a and b so 7 less than 10 is 10 minus 7 is 3 degree celsius so answer is option a number 6 there were 1010 pastries in a shop of which 175 were butterscotch pastries 240 were chocolate and the rest were pineapple what fraction were pineapple in the shop first let's, let's find out how many pineapple pastries are were there in the shop so let's first add we will add the butterscotch and chocolate pastries that is 175 plus 240 5 plus 0 is 5 7 plus 4 is 11 carry over 1 1 plus 1 2 plus 2 4 so total 455 pastries were butterscotch and chocolate so how many pastries were pineapple pastries 1010 minus 415 10 minus we borrow 1 here so it is 10 10 minus 5 is 5 here a 0 so we borrow 1 from here this is 10 10 minus 1 is 9 here 9 this place is 9 9 minus 4 is 5 total 595 pastries are pineapple pastries what is the fraction of 595 out of 1010 that is 595 divided by 1010 answer is option d kids i hope you understand this question please give a like seven varnika planted some plants in the garden in some row if number of plants in the row is same as the number of then which of the following options can represent the total number of plants it is given that number of rows and the number of plants in the rows are same so that means in which option both are same option a 9 multiplied by 9 is rows and number of plants are same others are different answer is option a Question number 8, 46 students from the class 3 contributed Rs. 2530 for Diwali party. How much money did one student contribute? If each student contributed equal amount, the total money is 2530 and students are 46. So how much money each student contributed? 2530 divided by 46 that is 55 we can check this answer by multiplying 46 by 35 40 and 55 also first we multiply 46 and 35 answer is not 2530 then try 40 answer is not 2530 then we multiply 55 and 46 and this is 2530 it will be easy to check the from the answers so now answer is option c question number nine a shopkeeper made five liter 345 milliliter of tomato ketchup on sunday and four liter 645 milliliter on monday how much tomato ketchup did he make in two days he made on first day 5 liter 345 milliliter and on second day he made 4 liter 645 milliliter. So how much ketchup did he make in two days? We will add them. 5 liter 345 milliliter plus 4 liter 645 milliliter that is 9 liter 990 milliliter. Answer is option D. Question number 10. Arman bought three items shown here. What was the cost of these three items? 
the cost of shirt is rupees 20 cost of book is rupees 10 and cost of rupee ice cream is rupees 5 so the co total cost is rupees 20 plus 10 30 plus 5 35 the answer is option b number 11 the given pictograph shows the number of hair clips five friends have Study the pictograph carefully and answer the following question. What is the difference between the number of hair clips Priya and Pihu have? Here, Priya has 5 and Pihu has 4. So, what is the difference between Priya and Pihu? 1. 5 minus 4 is 1. So, the difference between Priya and Pihu is 1 and each picture stands for 6 hair clips that means when we say 1, 1 bunch that means 6 hair clips. The difference between Priya's hair clip and Pihu's hair clip is total 6 hair clips. So answer is option C. I hope you understand this kit. Please give a like. Question number 12. Distance between the bank and the mall is twice the distance between Arun's home and the mall. Find the distance traveled by Arun. A. From his home to bank and back home. The distance between Arun's home to mall is 150 meter. So, the distance between mall and bank is twice of 150, that is 300. This distance is 300 meter. So Arun's home to bank is 150 plus 300, that is 450 meter. And Home to bank and back home. That means 450 plus 450 is 900 meter. So for option, for statement A, question A, answer is 900 meter. That is option A and D can be our answer. Option B and C is not our answer. Let's check for option B. Question B, from mall to bank and back to his home. Mall to bank is 300 meter and back to his home is 450 meter. So 300 plus 450 is 750. 0, 5, 3 plus 4 is 7. That is 750 meter. So our answer is option D. For part A, 900 meter. And part B, 750 meter. Number 13. Identify the four digit number. First, its one digit is smallest one digit odd number. What is smallest one digit odd number? Smallest one digit odd number is 1. So at 1's place, it is 1. Answer can be option A and C only. Option B and D are not our answer. Option B, its hundreds digit is 96 divided by 12. 96 divided by 12 is 8. 12 8s are 96. So, second is hundreds digit is 8. So our answer is option A because at hundreds place it is 8. In this, in option C, at hundreds place it is 6. So, C is not our answer. Let's check more. Its 10 digits is 4 times its first digit. The 10th digit is 4 multiplied by 1 is 4. So, it is, this is correct. Its 1000th digit is 2 more than its 10th digit. 10th digit is 4 and 2 more than 4 is 6. So, our answer is correct. Question number 14. Shania bought 2 kg potatoes, 1 kg radish and 1 by 2 kg apple. 
How much amount did she get back? If she gave rupees 500 to the shopkeeper. First, we find out how much money Shania spent to buy these items. 2 kg potatoes. 1 kg potatoes is 555 rupees. So, 2 kg is 55 multiplied by 2. That is 110 rupees. Half kg apple is 90 divided by 2. That means 45 rupees. And 1 kg radish. So, how much money? 110 plus 65 and 45. That is, if we add all of these, we get rupees 220. She spent 220 rupees and she gave rupees 500 to the shopkeeper. So, how much money she will get back? She get back 500 minus 220. That is 280. Answer is option B. I hope you understand kids. If you understand this question, please like this video. Question number 15. If these rows equal 35, rows multiplied by white flower equal 21 and white flower plus yellow flower equals 11, then yellow flower equal what? It's given that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 rows equals 35. R is for roses. 5 row R equals 35. So, 1 rows equal 35 divided by 5. That is 7. So, value of 1 rows is 7. And 1 rows multiplied by white flower equals 21. Rows multiplied by white flower equal 21. And rows is 7. 7 multiplied by white flower equals 21. And white flower equals 21 divided by 7. That is 3. So the value of white flower is 3. Now in this equation, white flower plus yellow flower equal 11. That means white flower is 7. White flower is 3. 3 plus yellow flower equals 11. So, yellow flower equals 11 minus 3, that is 8. Our answer is option B, 8. I hope it's clear, kids. Thanks for watching. If you find this video useful, please like, share and subscribe.